the continuation of more teen movies! Paper Towns. Alright, so Paper Towns is another teen movie written by the guy who gave us the, the Fault in Our Stars, you know, the cancer movie. Now, I've never read the book. And to be perfectly honest with you, I would have never read this book, even if I had to. If I had homework tomorrow, say, Darth Easy. Yeah, that's right. People at school call me Darth Easy. And they say, read Paper Town or you fail a class. I would probably look at Spark Notes because I would not read Paper Towns because I was not a fan of this movie. So what's the premise of this movie? Well, the movie is about this guy who, he lives across this girl called Margo. And he's had a crush on her for years. And they do like one last like heist thing together. And then she goes missing. And I have to say, I do not understand why this guy liked the girl. The girl was a complete douche. I think what it is, he really just thinks he likes her because the magic is in the mystery. You always imagine how you would date someone, but really, the truth, it probably wouldn't go out that way. Now, the story of this movie, it's not great. But, uh, like, the script. The script of this movie is completely cheesy. Like, the girl who plays Marco, I don't blame her as an actor. I just don't think she was given much to do during the movie. Her acting was so over the top. Like, uh, the main guy, he has a dream. And he sees Margo. And he's like, Margo, where have you been? And she goes, nowhere and everywhere. I was like, oh my god. She kept speaking in riddles. I was like, you're not Master Yoda. No, you're not. You are. <laughs> Now, some of the actors, I thought the acting in the movie was pretty well done. Like, the two best friends of the of the main guy, I liked them better than I liked him. Like, there was this really funny Pokemon moment in the movie. Just think just so it's not a car yourself. It's like, I want to be the very best. And you're just like, yes, Pokemon. That was the best part of the whole movie. Like, the one kid actor I really liked. Like the white guy, he was really hilarious in the movie. He has some really great moments in the movie. So in Paper Towns, it's not that great of a movie. The acting's alright, but the directing or the or the script in the movie was completely terrible. I think if this movie was a little more dark, maybe not so teeny, it probably would be a lot better. So I'm going to give Paper Towns a 3 out of 5. I'm giving it a fresh rating just because I enjoyed the acting and the Pokemon moment was pretty funny. Have you seen Paper Towns? What are your thoughts? Comment below, let me know. As always, guys, if you like this video, click that thumbs up button. Subscribe to see more. All too easy. Yeah.